Hello, everyone, and welcome to the PSL Season 9, Week 2! I'm your host, with the most, Silver Shadow. Uh, we're starting a little early, mostly because, actually, I'm sure, actually, pretty much both teams want to get started as soon as possibly can. So, that's why we're doing this a little early. It was originally a 7, well, actually, it was originally a 6.30, but got changed to 7, and I had to do it 15 minutes beforehand so I can actually get through all the intermissions and everything. And plus, actually, all the details for both teams, along with the maps, and then pretty much actually explain, actually, uh, so I don't have to pra uh, procrastinate. And also, I had to wait on a co-host. One of those things I'm still waiting for. Can you guess which one it is? Uh, <laughs> I don't know where my co-host is. <laughs> I have one. <laughs> they haven't showed up yet. Never mind, they're here. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> how, how do I know actually when actually my co-host comes? He beams down from the Enterprise. <laughs> Hi, Flair. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. Literally, you scared me. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, besides that, my co-host trying to scare the living crud out of me. Uh, how, how are you doing, by the way? I'm doing fine. Okay. <laughs> anyway, do you know what teams we're uh, are going to be battling today? Uh, give me the rundown. Well, the rundown's this. For week two, we have Team Soul with zero points, zero wins, zero losses, zero OT. What? Oh, that's right. Week one was our bye week. So pretty much... 
they're at they're at last place right now. Wow. Either actually that was that's very lucky to get actually the first week the bye week, or they're getting actually pretty much uh, their second week actually nothing. Oh God, Lord, I'm dropping frames like crazyville. Uh, I may have to actually not do that. <laughs> I know, I know what the problem was. Anyway, then uh, they're reversing against Sparkling Sea with two points, zero wins, three losses, and two overtime, uh, two overtime losses. I don't think their first week went well, Flair. <laughs> look like it. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to start that back up right now because you're reading off actually who is Team Soul. <sighs> stretch. Yeah. All right. Let me get this out of the way. It's Team Soul, we have ICM, Crash, Hard Two, Ember, and uh, Springs. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, how, by the way, when I was writing this, when I found M, I'm like, huh, and I'm gonna have Flair as a commentator. <laughs> well, this is gonna be funny. Yeah, sure, I guess. <laughs> so, now you're probably asking, who is Sparkling C? Well, Sparkling C is, is, uh, I am gonna get half these names wrong, and I apologize to Sparkling C. Orloxy, Math Wizard 7, Cyan, the Dark One's uh, seven eight three two K, and Van Brine. Not a bad team up, but where are these people gonna battle at? Flair, if you do not mind. This the week two maps are starting off turf four Wahoo World, uh, Splat Zones Crab Leg. Uh, Tower Control, Marlin, Rainmaker, Eeltail, and Clam Blitz, Barnacle, and Dime. A interesting bunch. I mean, we have technically Wahoo Pole, uh, a single zone map, a very odd, odd, hey face, uh, a very odd actually airport, a straightaway. And I guess actually pretty much everyone's having a sales on shoes. Where's the music splat? Uh, good question. You missed it. <laughs> we have a few more minutes before actually everything gets started. Like I said, I wanted to actually pretty much get this started because I know how sometimes actually teams are with being a little patient with actually um, the, co uh, the commentator and the co-com actually going through stuff. So... We have a we have some time, but I want to show you guys something. Huh? Something is I forgot to actually change it. Oh, uh, I need to make a tour. <laughs> uh, I need to turn on the video thing. Ooh, and I should probably change one of these silver shadows to flare. <laughs> I knew I've got something. <laughs> anyway, uh, I want to show you guys something. So usually I have to work PSL on somewhere in the test stage area. It's usually on that wall. So you're saying, well, where is it? I had a lot of time before the match. <laughs> I'm gonna leave that up. Hey, Geeky, is it playing tonight? No, we are not Storm. Uh, we are playing tomorrow and I am Dropping frames like Crazy Hill. Jeez, what is with my internet tonight? Sorry for actually the frames being dropped. Seriously. It, and actually, to comment actually what I, uh, Splat said earlier, it's not my potatoes. Well, okay, it is the, my potatoes, but fortunately, it's uh, potatoes I don't have control over. So, we're, ha we're having actually. Potato salad life? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I am going to do one thing for myself. Which is going here, going here, going here, and... There we go! Ah, I can hear the game! 
that it's probably more important if I actually pretty much if the commentator can hear the game. If anyone does know, I don't have speakers to actually for the sound, so I have to come through my OBS and into my computer and through my headphones. I had to go a workaround. Like most people who just plugs actually a headset into their Switch and call it, uh, call it a night. But, as you see more than enough of my bad art. Oh, hang on. Once again, the Switch is being actually proactive. There we go. Make sure you always test your equipment before actually it works. Otherwise, it's gonna actually malfunction probably. <laughs> uh, my potatoes are broken. And Icy has not sent a password yet. Let's go ahead and go back to the team versus. That was, uh, pretty deductive. But, as anything else... Blair, any predictions for tonight? Uh... What's your predictions? First of all, my prediction is I'm getting raided by Big Mochi! With a party of two! Hello, Raiders! Welcome uh, to the PSL match for Team Soul vs. Sparkling Sea! I assume actually Soul is probably gonna actually uh have some points here to win uh win the match. <laughs> totally not uh, not me uh forgetting that today's not Wednesday. <laughs> you can't fool me. Stormfly is not a raider. They were here <laughs> ten minutes ago. No, no, no. Uh, I'm su <laughs> I'm assuming it's your uh your local and Big Mochi actually the two raiders. <laughs> totally not being silly today. Well, you're going from one silly commentator to another silly commentator. <laughs> oh my god. In any case, trust me. <laughs> I had that same time actually pretty much uh, for me when I, uh... No, Moji, do not worry. Trust me. I had that exact same moment. When, uh, I was supposed to actually do... Uh -huh. Press F X to doubt. Okay, you said it. X. <laughs> um, I I had actually that few problems beforehand when I was supposed to actually be streaming one moment and next moment I I forgot. <laughs> so, <laughs> oops. All right, it's seven o'clock. We are actually pretty much uh waiting on some information from Team Soul and or. Sparkling Sea. Uh, any predictions for you, uh, Flair? Uh, let's see. My predictions is probably like a close match hmm. set up with probably with I think I have my money on Soul taking the set overall. Same, very same. Shadows and friends. <laughs> why do I why do I feel like I'm part of Garfield and friends? Well, I'm doing pretty well. I'm hyped that I finally got a match. Seriously, I I was actually pretty much here. Here's my thing. Since I'm part of actually the uh, the PSL, uh. The one thing actually I'm trying to try to do is get at least one week per uh a one match per week type of deal. Because one, I'm part of a team on here. If you're always wondering about that, please gotta go to my uh to my YouTube and pretty much look at the schedule. Hint hint wink wink. And we'll see actually pretty much what happens there. But we're not here for me, we're not here for my team, we're not actually here for anything else, but for some battles, and I will send Flair the password. Alright. Cool, because I was about to yell at people. They don't... <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 give me a break, give me a break, I'm one, I'm one streamer, okay? I can't do everything. 
Alright. Alright, switching to the other screen. Alright. The uh, password. The password uh, one, is one, two, three, four. <laughs> Same password on my lips. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Backwards, it's mine. Okay. We have icy Someone ember. I changed the password on my luggage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I will have to go check your luggage and make sure everything's in there then. Here, here's the blowtorch. Get, uh, get to your luggage. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, uh, player, doesn't one of these names remind you of something? Huh? Doesn't one of these names in here remind you of something? No. Are you sure? Maybe the I'm fourth sure. one down? <laughs> one, two, three. Rash 94. I said, I said the fourth one down. <laughs> the one above my name? No, I don't care. <laughs> you know I'm gonna tease my you. Question is, my question is, where is... I have no idea. But they should show up actually pretty much in the, the 12 minute mark. Otherwise, they, it is a forfeit and I do not have a stream. Uh, will the real sparkling sea please stand up? I hope someone wins. Well, it might be just Team Soul for an automatic victory. There they are! There, There's, we there we go. There's Mathwiz. There's Oxy. Oxy? I don't know. Cyan? Just took him a second. Uh, stupid question on my part. Did I... I think I did. I did. Okay, cool. Let's go, Soul! Let's go! Whoever wins, name here. Shout out to, Bi uh, to Big Icy. But, uh... We need one more Sparkling Sea member. Unless we're having a three-on-three. -three. <laughs> Hello, Togehias! Oi! Now, every time I hear that, uh, Toge, yes, every time, I think of not actually pretty much the greeting of hi, I think of actually pretty much of, oh yeah, from O Ranger from the Super Sentai series. Thank you. <laughs> hi, Em! Hey, Em, how, how are you by chat and also actually playing the game? <laughs> uh, the fact that we're still waiting on another player. We are waiting on one more Sparkling Sea player. I watch him play at the same time. Oh my god! Am how? I know you're a good multitasker. Oh, Ranger Fucks. <laughs> Oh, thank goodness, thank goodness that these matches do not have actually my chat display up. Uh, but as we actually pretty much wait for this final Sparkling C player, I am running out actually pretty much. I woke up an hour ago. <laughs> it's always good to actually support your favorite streamer while playing. I mean, I watch a video every single time I'm playing Splatoon, so, hey, not everyone's perfect, and not everyone actually, uh, has their own niches. Are you telling me I'm wrong? Oh, Ranger. Oh, okay, I thought you were disking, I thought you were disking, actually, uh, t uh, Toki Kiss. Okay, so you're saying, actually, O Ranger is actually a, a good Sentai. My personal favorite is actually Go Kaiser. To see how I lose. <laughs> Wait, I don't have. 
think that's I think the only Sentai series I know through sets uh in America isn't that like Mega Super Mega Force? Uh Super Mega Force was Go Kaiser and it yeah. it fell so through. That's the only one I know is because Super Mega Force was awful. It was awful <laughs> compared to the Sentai. That means we got couple scenes that were actually kind of good, and that was it. It ruined the pirate one. <laughs> the, <laughs> the, the two things that they never explained is how Jake went from to being the Black Ranger to the Green Ranger, because we never got the explanation for it. And two, they went from like a, like a, uh, like a normal blaster to an old-fashioned gun. A simple explanation for that. <laughs> now go fight. <laughs> There's a simple explanation for that. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, in any case, actually, Go Kaiser is, is pretty much my number one. Uh, to let you anyone know, I had not followed Super Sentai for anything beyond uh, Pat, uh, anything that is before Go Kaiser. Unfortunately, I am. I started late on it. But my uh, my next favorite one is actually gonna be probably Lupin versus Pada. The pistols made sense because it's just pirates, but still. <laughs> yeah, Super Mega Force did suck. I I totally agree with you, Toga. I really do. Uh. Are we going to have actually pretty much that fourth member come up yet? Uh, five minutes. Yeah, they have five minutes to actually, otherwise it... Unless, unless actually Team Soul wants to do a three on three. It is not unheard of. I think the first three on three was actually during season two. As long as long, uh, both captains are agreed to it. And both captains are here. I've just been playing with uh, yellow blue cards yeah. for like 10 minutes. And, um... That, uh, that one had... Which, uh, which special is that one? It's Zuka and Dempsey. Yeah, okay. I, I keep thinking actually that one. I, I'm probably thinking back at two where actually they have the booyah bomb. That's the blue one. Yeah, I. Booyah. The vanilla pit in this game. Yeah, I know. I keep thinking actually Deco actually keeps having uh, booyah bomb, but I keep telling my brain that is wrong, Silver. That is wrong. Uh, does anyone know actually what's happening actually with Team uh, Team Sparkling Sea? Because <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Uh, how about we message Icy? Actually, uh, let's see here. Let, let's do a little fun, shall we? A little fun? No. Oh. Are we... Wait, what? Are we going? Okay, we're doing a, a 3v4. A 4v3, a... Uh, or we're a playing in Team Soul. <laughs> I see. Uh... I see Mari messed up the room. <laughs> okay, no. guys, we're playing Sparkly C right here. Come on, come on. After we, do they want the room reset? Like they probably want the room resetted. <laughs> well, Flair's playing. You got your wish. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Guys, should I should I click this? <laughs> should I click uh, should I click this? There's the Among Us. Tell you to end the uh, end the battle. I don't know. I just did it anyways because it's the wrong teams anyways. I'm not. I don't even know what he he was thinking. I'm not an SPC member. Neither are you. So. If everyone want to pick me, no, I'm just joking. I'm I'm on Geek Inc. It's actually an exciting match. Who won? <laughs> like either way, it's an illegal match. <laughs> yeah, it was an illegal match. <laughs> But still. Mm. Uh, I think they probably wanted to set us up for V3 or something. I don't know. Because <laughs> I haven't seen or heard anything yet. So that one goes to the commentators, right? Yes! <laughs> that one goes to the commentators. Okay, uh, IT said actually, uh, it's going to be a 3v4. Uh, just uh, yeah. switch it too fast, uh, setting the teams. <laughs> One for Tom? Let's see here. Right. Hang on. <laughs> and I see the room, oh, so he's the one setting the team. Yeah, I know, he just went too far. Senpai. I don't know. There we go. Right. I guess they're playing. Uh, I guess they're playing. Also, because actually now we all made the joke of actually the commentaries get a point. Ding. Oh, can't see it. Ding. <laughs> so far, we're in the lead, guys. We're in the lead. <laughs> oh my god. Why do people watch me? <laughs> sparkling is okay. They're, they are par uh, sparkling. So it's right. it's a it's a true blue battle. Alright, so it's a 2-4-V-4, let's go. Alright, so we do have a fair actual match. <laughs> we actually have a match! Interesting! Hey, it's Blood Tunnel Wiper! Alright, for Team Soul, we have the Orange Inzep, a Inkbrush, Splat Dooley's, and the, uh, ugh, I can't talk tonight. Uh, the Bullpoint Splat Lane. For Sparkling Sea, we have the Incline Tri Stringer, the Splatter Shot, a Splat Tana, and a T Tap. It's pretty much, uh, the Splatter, uh, the Splat Tana is trying their best actually to not get flanked by whoever that was. I can't tell who it was. But when they came right back up, it was the Splat Duelist who gets actually crushed by the Splatana. Uh, some chumps come out to actually uh, to disperse everyone. Icy goes down to the Splatana. The Splatana is making some work tonight. As everything actually goes around, we're gonna take uh, uh, to a top of uh, view. Sparkling Sea is in the lead just slightly. Splatana does go down though. Inkjet coming out. Inkjet's gonna get the T Tech. That's one down for Splatting Sea. Two down for s a Sparkling Sea. Chumps come out from the Tri Stringer here. As Team Soul is gonna move a bit forward into Team's to Sparkling Sea territory. 
Hammer comes out, takes out the Splatling. Hammer's gonna come into mid. Icy's gonna have to drop down to avoid the Hammer. Icy climbs back up. He's gonna try to challenge the Splatling. This, I mean, the Splatana, Splatana takes him out. The Wiper takes him out. Strikes come out. The ball point gets the kill on the T-Tech. Zuka comes out. Zuka doesn't get anyone, but the, the, the small sword gets two. It's just the brush. The brush is practically corner here. The brush has to jump out. One minute left. Team um, Sparkling C has mid control right now. So Team Soul is going to have some work to try to get back into mid and try to take more of the zone. Control here. Two down for Sparkling C. Chumps come out. Oh, the T-Tech is right. The T-Tech goes down to the brush. The Stringer has to move out. Team Soul takes control of mid here with about 30 seconds left. Zuka comes... I mean, Inkjet comes out. A crab Inkjet gets no one, but the Crab Tank is going to continue the pressure here. And here comes Whale. You gotta watch out for the Hammer. The Hammer comes out. The Splat... The Dually drops down. Team Soul... I'm um, Team SPC is going to take back mid control here. One down for Team Soul. The Wiper drops. Chumps comes out. Tri Strike comes out. One down for each side. Amber does get Two down for each side. And. Ended. And ended. Looks like uh, Sparkling Seed took the top of mid. And ooh, this looks ooh, like this more side to Sparkling Seed. Yeah. Yes. Sparkling Seed. Wow. So that's two points for Sparkling Sea. That was that was actually kind of interesting. <laughs> those uh, those were so not turf comps, uh, low key. Uh, well, I could blame you, Toby. Yes, I could blame you. Technically, uh. I have never seen actually a Splatana in Turf War that much besides me. So, GG on that one. Mm. I mean, I have seen plenty of actually ball points. I have seen plenty of uh, T-Tex. I have seen actually pretty much those ones, but... <laughs> I'm like, uh, what? In any case, we get ready for actually our next match. <laughs> um, as we go on to Crab Lake Capital Splat Zones. And I would also like to actually say, let's go ahead and bring back a personal favorite thing of mine. How about we take a wild guess about you pretty much what weapons we're going to see. And I'm going to predict a Splatana Stamper Nouveau. Not something out of the range, tragic with crab tank and pretty much everything else. What about you, Flair? Any uh, weapon guesses? I could see that. Um, let's see. I might fill a pencil here. This is basically. Oh, pencil just goes anywhere, especially this is flat zones. So especially flat zones. Pencil is. Yeah, there, there you go. <laughs> There's two pencils now. Go ahead, Flair. I saw that drink game. We saw about maybe two shots. For Soul, we have the splatter shot. We have the ink brush. We have the do the splat duels, and we have the cooler pencil. On Sparkling Sea, we have the cooler pencil. We have the splatter shot. We have the range, and we have the range blaster, and we have the splat roller. Team Soul takes an immediate lead. It's just a splat roll. The splat roll gets wailed. And now everything, everyone from Sparkling Sea is now just coming back in. Cooler is popped out from or Sparkling Sea here. Sparkling Sea's pencil goes down to M. Down to 65. Zuka comes out, gets the opposing uh, splatter shot here. I have no clue what Ember is doing. They're just literally sitting there. But, of any case, 
It looks like actually Team Soul is taking a major pick. I don't know why actually the pencil threw out their cooler way out into the middle of, of the of the damn zone, but have fun with that. Yeah, Team Soul's having major con a big control. The roller is gonna try to come into mid. The roller is gonna go down to the brush. About seven counts left. That's gonna be a fast and dominant victory for Team Soul here. A complete change out actually from Turf War. She's That's three points to Team Soul. I agree, uh, please. That was quick. Uh, perhaps you might want to get that looked at. <laughs> please tell me everyone saw that. That actually the duelies were going through his hands. <laughs> uh, I mean, case. That was. That was obligatory fast. Uh, I feel like actually Sparkling CD even had a chance on that. Well, yeah, this was a, this was a Sparkling CD went down to Team Soul basically got control of mid and they pretty that, much were able yeah, to lock they, out. They never let go. They never let go. Uh, of any case, up next is gonna be Tower Control Marlin Airport. Oh, Marlin Airport. I'm gonna say... You know what? The Reflux. The Tent of, uh, the tent of Missiles one. Not the Reef Slider, but the Tent of, uh, tent of Missiles. And to add, I don't think uh, Team uh, Sparkling Sea had like a good retake. Like They had Cooler, which, which is all... Which and let them respond in faster, take aggressive hits, but they didn't have like a crab, a jet, or like really anything. Maybe Zuka, but like Zuka isn't that consistent. So like, as, as basically a, a lottery. So like basically, once they lost the first match, it was basically a very high uphill battle just to get in, get back in. I mean... Here, 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 here's the, here's the thing, here's the thing, and this is coming from a roller uh, main. Roller is no good on actually that map with that mode. It's no good. It, it's a good, it's a good protector, and that's it. Oh, we see more pencils. On Team Soul, we have the Hero Shot Replica, Ink Brush, Splat Dooleys, and the Snipe Rider 5H. On Sparkling Sea, we have the Tri Slasher Nouveau, a Fire a Fire Fin Zeko uh, Splat Charger, a Order Replica Splatter Shot, and a Dead Silver Trash Can. Intriguing. As we actually take a look, it looks like some whales are coming out to actually pretty much to get everyone off of that tower. And here is trying their best actually to actually take out a couple people. Took and had their teammates actually take out a few, and also actually take out another sparkling sea member, popping a soda on a tower. And we are getting past that first checkpoint, which is rushing right through it. And I don't even know what happened to actually to that uh, Zeko Finn. That Zeko Finn. Yeah. Uh... Go ahead. Yeah, ooh, it's just a charger here. Charger's off by himself. Zuka's gonna come out. It's gonna get pinched by the brush. Brush takes out the sniper here. We're down to the final checkpoint here. Team Soul still in control right now. It's, it's, the shot is down. Two two down for for both sides. It's just the duelies for Team Soul right now. The dudes is gonna looks like they're gonna try to move out. Move back out. Cooler comes out for Sparkling Sea here. Crab Tank comes out. He's gonna try to pressure. Try strikes come out and that cancels out the Crab Tank game. The, the tower moves back into center. Here comes specials to try Zook before Sparkling Sea well to counter it. The shot goes down. The brush is gonna go fight the, the sniper. The sniper jumps back out. The air spray takes control of the tower, but goes down to the brush here. As Crash actually is protecting this midline with Crab Tank. 
but some tri strikes are trying to get him down. Crash is probably gonna go down to Cyan. Cyan uh, deals with the crab tank, and the order replica shot is actually pretty much being splatted. It's just Charger once again. Charger getting pressured by the brush. The brush misses the Charger, but trades with a shot here. Pretty much IC is trying their best to actually to take down, takes two down with the Zooka, but then it's taken down as well. As the tower is stopped on this la uh, final checkpoint. Taken back yeah, actually uh, from Team Soul to Team uh, Sparkling Sea to back to Team Soul once again. Crash is trying their best to actually get everything down. This Zeka Finn is trying their best actually to get uh, Crash on. Yeah, no one's looking at tower. No one's looking at tower here. Oh and they boy. Get through the checkpoint in. As Aaron was distracted by the duelies here, the tower that too just summons to get on and no one gets on it here. Try to still come out. That's going to leave the tower at two. The tower is coming right back at you forward. Icy jumps into a very particular location. Senpai reef sliders in. Don't know how efficient that was. And get three people down to a splat bomb. Yeah, and that splat bomb basically sealed the game then. The tri slasher was just a bit too far out. That's six points. Oh. That's six points to actually two teams. So let's see that uh, that is correct. There we go. Once again, crashes to find logic. That that Bob actually pretty much annihilated Team uh, Sparkling C. So I have a question for this. Is Soul is gonna actually pretty much take all the rank battles and pocket them for a whole win? I am gonna butcher this name, so I am sorry. Your local Segosaurus, uh, your sub. Thank you for the follow. It's... Uh, you'll tell Rainmix. I think this is the only map you'll tell is legal on. <laughs> 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 I, think, I think you're right. Mm. Actually, I was taking a look at the maps. I was a little surprised, actually. Pretty much only, like, two maps. Like, I know Bluefin Splat Zones is the only legal one we have. It's not a bad map for Splatoon 1, that's still a bad map in this video game. Who knew? <laughs> I mean... It's not a bad map, it's just had bad design. Splatoon 1 designed it was actually pretty good. Fun fact, Ezo at Raymaker uh, Raymake is banned in Sindo Q. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> that is a fun yes. fact. Can you even play like you tell in Sindo Q? I don't I don't know what the maps remember. are actually pretty much in Sindo Q are, unfortunately. I, I don't even know where to find them. Uh as we go ahead and actually pretty much ready up actually for Well, hopefully. Not the final, final time. Because we still got actually a uh, clan blitz after this. You can play Eel Tail like Tower Control. <laughs> Is that the only one to kiss? Hmm. Player, take it away. Alright, for Team Soul, we got the Splash Shot, we got the Ink Brush, we got the Splat Duelist, and we got the. Pencil cooler for Sparkling Sea. We have the Splatter Shot. We have the Insect 85. We have the Splatter Shot, and we have the Rapid Pro. I was gonna say there's no cooler on actually on C, but then I saw the end zap. But as we actually take a look at you both, it looks like uh, the Rainmaker was previously popped actually by uh, Team Soul, who and grabs it. Interesting. It looks Not like bad option. You already have cooler. The Rainmaker is going to get past the first checkpoint pretty quickly here. 
Oh, but it looks like Spartan Sea is going to take the pop. That pop gets two. That Zuga gets another one. Brush gets sucked by the vacuum. And Spartan Sea is going to have the Rainmaker here. Let's see if they can do anything with it. I see. The I see. shot goes down. Trizuga comes out for Soul here. I see gets taken down by the Rainmaker and pretty much uh, having actually Map Wizard by by themselves. But it's taken out by the Enzap. Oh, not the Enzap. That's their same team member. I don't know what takes them now, actually. Amber does Rush actually. takes the Rainmaker. Rainmaker is going to go through the Uninkable Alleyway and goes down being pinched by the shot. Interesting way to uh, go through. Math Wizard is trying their best actually to mostly pop, actually, this uh, Rainmaker. Takes it actually over to the bridge and then fires underneath the bridge to actually to actually go for a sneaky way over. Killer whales do come out to actually trying to stop uh, Math Wiz. And goes on top of the bridge, tries to go for that first Rainmaker uh, checkpoint and gets stopped right before it. And Crash actually grabs a drink, everyone grabs, uh, grabs a drink, and that first Rainmaker checkpoint is broken at 51 points. Unfortunately, Sparkling Sea has a lot more to go for. Oh, that Zuba got that crab thing. It's too down for Team Soul. Icy has the Rainmaker. As we see, Math Wiz actually trying their best to actually uh, to avoid attacks and also actually try to find that Rainmaker. Icy has the Rainmaker. Trying their best, Mathwiz is trying to splat Icy and succeed as with actually some spread shot. I can't tell you how many times I died to those. Trizuka does come out, trying to pop the Rainmaker shield. No shots are actually available. And Mathwiz does get taken down by Soul. Oh, and this is big here. Delayed Wipeout and like Team Soul has their Rainmaker. Zuga comes out. Zuga gets one. The Dewey's is gonna make shop at near spawn here. It's Meanwhile the Rainmaker, the pencil's trying to break it. Pencil breaks it. Crash gets the Rainmaker here, but but goes down immediately on the ramp here. This is definitely an interesting uh Turn of events. That Rainmaker is so deep in sea, uh, Sparkling Seas territory, they need to get that out of there. Get over to Team Souls very quickly. Zion has the Rainmaker get splatted by Icy. And that um, Rainmaker is sitting pretty in Sparkling Seas base. Math Wizard does go down. Amber is trying their best, actually, to get that Rainmaker shield down. Getting contested with. The uh, Rapid Blaster Pro, De uh, Rapid Blaster Pro, not Deco. Icy grabs uh, the Rainmaker, gets struggling so slowly through the Toxic Mist. Can he actually make it uh, to the uh, final pedestal? And he's gonna try and get stopped at four points by Cyan. We're down to the last minute. Team Soul. Kind of going down a bit. I think I think this is a part of the match where you start getting a bit conservative here. You don't. You're already down to four, so like, in so like you just need kind of just play defense here. You really do. No reason, no reason to go go aggressive here. You kind of have to have the rainmaker come to you now. That was right. down for Team Soul. M is trying to make some shots actually happen. Gets splatted. In, in mid shots, Mathwiz has the Rainmaker and trying their best to actually to play defense. I don't know why, because they have watch 50... the brush here. The brush drops the bomb, gets the kill here, and we have a game for Team Soul. That is nine points to Team Soul. I, I, I had my down back at turf war, but I don't have them anymore. As we see more Defiant Logic with a fist bump with uh, Ember and Icy. I mean, turf war was really close. I think it's like, the problem is that Team Soul went down at the worst time. At near the end of the, near the end of the match, like the last 30 seconds or so. 
somewhere within the last 30 seconds. Which allowed uh, Sparkling Sea just to break in to mid. As we see, pretty much everything is going all toxic. I mean, uh, I think if they had like a cooler on that match. They did. They it was the end zone. I was talking about the turf one match. Oh, yeah. Soul. Maybe they weren't trying to go for turf, uh, turf or cooler. Eh. Anyway, Clan Blitz, Sparkle, and Dime is next. Maybe actually Sparkle, you can see, mm, excuse me, can actually make us some points right here uh, with this awful mode and this interesting map. I have very mixed feelings about Clan Blitz and Barnacle and Dime. But as we actually... Um, I, okay. A flare. Do believe me I'm wrong, but Barnacle and Dime, what do you think of it? It's a map. It's a what? It's a map. It, it's, a, it's a map made by Nintendo. Yes. It, you have nowhere to go. Like, seriously, you just need actually pretty much a cooler and two uh, inkjets and pretty much are safe for the whole thing. Say that about a handful of map. Yeah, you can, but still. This one's actually really shows for it. All right. On Team Soul, we have the Hero Shot Replica, an Ink Brush, a Splat Dooley's, and a Pencil 5H. On Sparkling Sea, we have the Sniper 5H, a Splatter Shot, a Splat Tonda Wiper, and a Splat Roller, personal favorite of mine. We see actually pretty much both teams going at towards the middle and having actually pretty much being taken down one for each. And Sparkling Sea is down to just the Roller. Roller does get taken out by the Ink Brush. And it's a delay wipeout as Icy takes on the challenge of actually putting, uh, putting a clam inside the basket and it's going down, down, down with that point system. And we have up to 48 points. They are past the halfway mark. Can actually a sparkling see it recover from this, or do we see actually more? 45. 42. And I'm getting delayed on my side. Uh, how, <laughs> how much of a delay? Because, like, you said 42, then, like, I mean, 45 to 42, and, like, each time you said it, it didn't happen until, like, a second later. Weird. Yeah. Uh, Nintendo, please fix actually potatoes. And, like, it looked like the basket was supposed to close, but then, like, it opens back up. So, then, like, that's... Ba like, what? Good, though, it's spectator lag. Yeah, that, yeah, that's spectator lag. Either way, uh, Soul has two power clamps, six red clamps, and a Trizuka coming out with a whale. That's gonna be 40 points down to 31 here. Hammer comes out. It's not gonna do anything here. The, the wiper goes down. Well, a few more clamps come out. We're down to 25 here. As we see, never get there in time. It's just the pencil. The pencil jumps out safely and Sparkling Sea is gonna run, try to get some mid control here and try to set up a push on their own here. It looks like actually pretty much uh, uh, Sparkling Sea is trying to use a, a Trituka to their advantage but having actually zero luck and zero picks towards it, Bubbler does come out and takes down Crash right behind them. And also Icy but M takes actually pretty much the shot down. It's a delayed wipeout with the uh, Splatana Wiper only by their end. M does make a power clamp, throws it and picks it right back up. And keeps a hold on to it until uh, time is needed. Takes a long shot to map Wizard. Barbon has have mid control, but they're not able to stay alive to take advantage of it. Wow. Two down. There's a jump, that goes down, Team Solo's gonna get control of mid here. And they have two power clans. 
I see here actually has the power slam trying to make the best, but gets taken out by Splat Roller with the help of they the have torpedo. Two power clams, they just need about two extra clams just to end this game. So, turns to watch out. M gets the first score. We're down to 25 and three penalty. We're down to eight. We need three more clams. The, looks like the Dooleys and the Brush have them. The Brush is gonna score, and that's gonna be game. Man, not even an overtime point. And Team Soul is taking the whole match with 12 points. 12 points is also actually pretty much uh, taken off the board. Uh, go ahead and scoot those over. Let's see here. There we go. With 12 points, that was a very a uh, wait. I seriously, like I said, I thought Turf War was actually pretty much going to Sparkling Sea, and then this whole entire match was actually going to be a, to a total copyright uh, claim, actually, for me to actually t uh, tell me. Oh, well, I guess I'm wrong for actually Team Soul. Nope. They proved me wrong twice. I am. <laughs> of any case, I think that's going to be it for tonight. <laughs> As we watch M actually pretty much hopping down. Let's go ahead and actually talk about the PSL schedule because. We're not the only ones actually having some times. We have all a bunch of week twos coming right up. Not a lot of them scheduled, but do not worry. We are still looking for those commentators. Cross Country Couples versus on Green Kraken will be next actually tomorrow, along with Geek Inc. versus Splashdown Crusaders. One will be at 9, the other one will be at 10. Easter and Daylight Savings time, of course. So let's go ahead and actually see uh, see what's actually everything else is happening. I don't think anyone else is going to be broadcasting because I think I'm the last one for tonight. Dang. But of any case, Flair, do you have anything to say? Well, you're going to chill and I'm going to be waiting at you for my match tomorrow. Remember... To stay unique!